Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. So today I'm coming at you with another top five video. This is my top five Halloween iPhone and iPad games. So again, disclaimer, this is my top five. It doesn't have to be your top five or your mom's top five, it's mine. So don't complain and say, no, these are not the top five best games for iPhone and iPad. This is my opinion. So again, these are five free Halloween themed games that I think deserve to be on a top five list somewhere out on the interweb. So let's go ahead and jump into it. So for my number five game for top five Halloween games is... All right, guys, so my number five game is a game that I downloaded immediately when it came out. The name of the game is I Hate Zombies. So let's go ahead and jump into it. Basically, you unlock all of these cool cars. I'm going to go ahead and go with my Pink Flamingo here. Uh, so it is a free game, so it, uh, it has ads or whatnot. So we're going to go ahead and get through those. And then basically, you're it's just an endless runner in which you're trying to squash zombies with your car. So you have uh, the right key there to, to flip forward, the back to flip back. And then you see that green stuff on your screen there. That indeed, my friends, that was terrible. That indeed is zombie guts. So basically, you're just riding around town trying to squash zombies. So hopefully I'll do better this next time. So again, the name of the game is I Hate Zombies. You can unlock new cars. You can unlock new power-ups. Uh, and the zombie theme to me is just really cool uh, for the Halloween season. So you see here, got my nice pink caddy here. Uh, get an epic landing there uh, and then basically you can even drag down on your finger and squish zombies as they're on the screen there so again the name of this game is I hate zombies and now for my number four Halloween game of the year All right, guys, I know you're going to say that I'm cheating by picking this game. I promise you I am not cheating. Fruit Ninja did an awesome update, and I think that it deserves to be on this Halloween Top 5 list. So basically, they just changed the theme. So it's basically normal old Fruit Ninja, which is addictive as everything. And it's basically just the fruit in more of a translucent color. And then when you slice stuff, it's got like a laser. It just looks all Halloween-y with the purple goo and the orange goo and whatnot. But the whole deal is is reinvented. I mean, they're like I said, they're not, they're not reinventing the wheel per se but they just completely changed the theme and they really made it more halloween-esque the ghostbuster theme kind of deal but as you can see here it just got it's got a nice really cool look to it and again as with all of the games on this list this game is indeed free and as you can see there uh it's got a nice halloween skin on it uh and i thought that it in, you know needed to be included on this halloween top five list so again that is number four fruit ninja go check it out if you haven't already i'm sure you have and now to number three Number three on my list this year is Dead Ahead. So this game here, maybe I like it because you're riding around on a scooter and you're trying to run over zombies and there's boss zombies and there's all kind of good crazy stuff. But anyways, uh, you can choose your bikes here. You got all kind of different bikes. We'll go with this uh, beginner scooter here just because for purposes of this video and we'll go ahead and hit play. So basically what you're doing is here, um, you're accelerating with the left stick there and then going up or down on the right joystick to go left or right. And then we're trying to run over zombies zombies. You know, I really don't know why I picked this game. Maybe because I played it for an ungodly amount of time when I downloaded it. Uh, but maybe it's just because you're riding around on a pink moped trying to run over zombies. Maybe that's what it is. I really don't know. Uh, but either way, I really enjoy this game. Uh, at the end of each level, there are like boss zombies that you have to shoot and things like that. So basically, you know, you have like guns that you can unlock. You have different scooters that you can unlock. But the main premise of the game is basically, hey, take your moped, whatever it may be, like you just got nitro there, which is just crazy, and run over zombies. Zombies. And then zombie parts begin to fly everywhere. And then here's the big guy uh, at the back there. Uh, what's going to happen? Oh, oh he's going to catch me. Uh, like I said, I, re I really don't know. I mean, you know, Dead Ahead is a game that, you know, you download and you play it for like an hour and you're like, what just happened to my life? Um, so again, guys, the name of the game is Dead Ahead. If you haven't downloaded it, which you may have not, because uh, it is a fairly obscure title, go check that download link out in the description and let me know what you think. Now, to the number two game on my list. 
All right, guys, for the number two game on my list, what Halloween top five list would be complete without a Ghostbusters title in the list? So this is the Ghostbusters game for iOS here. Uh, and then as you can see, uh, we're going to go to this house here. And basically, you're doing what Ghostbusters do best, man. You're busting ghosts. Uh, so it's got some really cool uh, looking uh, graphics in the game and you're just creeping up around these different hallways and alleyways and you're trying to bust ghosts. You got different type of Ghostbusters. One of them is like a heavy hitter artillery. Another one's up close and personal. And then there's a scientist who like heals all your guys. So basically this here is just uh, uh, something in our way. Uh, so we're going to tap here. We kind of just saw something there. You know, the Ghostbusters, whatever it may be. Uh, so basically you can look at your, your overview here. So once the Ghostbusters are called out, you're going to see different icons here, but you're basically going to be traveling, and here's some rat ghosts and things like that. That's absolutely crazy. So you can just you drag the lines to the ghost, and then uh, as your guys begin to lose help, you can use your scientist to, to do that. And there's also power-ups like Terra and Med Wands and things like that that you can use. Uh, but this guy is dying, so we're going to go ahead and heal him. Uh, so we can tap on the double healing ability to heal more people. Uh, and then basically we're just going here guys and we are trying to bust ghosts like these little rat turds here trying to just bust them. Uh, so anyways, again, the name of this game is Ghostbusters. Go check it out. They're all free. This one is fantastic. Don't forget to check it out. And now for my number one game on the list. All right, guys, so definitely the number one game on my list for Halloween iPhone and iPad games is definitely Into the Dead. It is one of the most amazing, really cool zombie games, uh, and it's free on the iPhone and iPad. So we're going to go ahead and jump into it here. Go ahead and play classic mode and then let you see kind of what it's all about. So we're going to go ahead and equip ourselves with, how about that perk there? And that sounds good there. So basically, you're running through a field of zombies. Uh, you're like on a, you're playing crashes, and you got zombies all around. Okay, and basically, you know, you you you've got to shoot these zombies who are trying to get to to basically kill you. So you're you're going left or right by tilting. Okay, or you can swipe your finger. It just depends on what you want to do. Uh, and you're just going through this field of zombies, and you're just tapping on your screen where you want to kill the zombie. So basically, if the zombies get to you, like right now I'm out of ammunition, so basically I'm trying to dodge these guys, but basically I'm doing kind of a good job at it, but he's about to get me. Come on, come on. Oh, he's about to get me. So basically you're trying to dodge the zombies, and right now without any ammunition it's a little difficult. So once you run into one, he gets you and attacks you and eats you, basically. It's kind of morbid. But anyways, this game is Into the Dead, and then once that happens, you know, you're scored by how far you get out into the field, and then you want to unlock more ammunition and more guns and things like that, and you can do that by like the three-star system and how well you do on certain levels. Uh, but again, the name of the game is Into the Dead. I did a full review on it, actually, on my channel, uh, and it is a free game, uh, so go check that out. All the download links will be down below, and you can see your armory here. You can check out all the different weapons and things like that uh, that you can unlock by by you know doing well uh, within a certain level or whatever it may be. So anyways, guys, this has been my top five list for Halloween games this year, 2014. Doesn't mean it is yours. It doesn't mean it is the scariest games. It just means these were my top five games. Now, in the description box below, list your top five Halloween-themed games. And I know there's a ton of them. There's like uh, Five Nights at Freddy. There are The Room, The Room 2. There's a ton of other games that are paid games that are fantastic. But put yours in the description description box below. Don't forget to like this video. Hit that thumbs up button down below. Share it with your friends and your family. And don't forget to go over to my Patreon page and support me to get some really cool stuff. And guys, as always, thanks for watching my videos and I will see you in the next one.